one of those as Casey will play away for Byrne and it'll pop up in the midfield. Straight out the back from Ryan. Oh, and it's good from Ireland through Van der Fleer, who's finding another one of those gaps, and Lowe struggled to catch it, but did, and fed Bundy a key. It's sublime from the Irish. Intercepted this ball, is it Garbisi? This is over the top. Again, it wasn't there, wasn't on, but they do force it, and sometimes when you force it, you make the mistake, and that was the mistake. And when it comes out, again, it's a numbers game. Capowatso's just held up. Garbisi can't do anything, and Bundia looks to pass, but he just rides Varney. Yes, yeah. He's that big a lad, he's that powerful, he can carry him over. Nice. Van de Fleer, beautiful hands back inside, and this one is given. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. <laughs> Inwardly, he will be happy with obviously the bonus point and the score, but again, another chance gone begging. Van de Fleer. What's the face to a key? Oh, it's the intercept. It's going to be a chance for Pierre Bruno to get on his bike over the 10 metre line. Bruno will not be caught. Italy get their second try of the match right on the stroke of half time. There you go, for all love and money, they were flooding that right hand side, wasn't it? Bundiaki, who's been a, a thorn in Italian's side, actually gifts Bruno a good score. It's a foot race, Van der Fleer ain't going to stop him, none of the wingers are going to stop him. There's a lot of ageing bodies in that Welsh side in this Welsh squad, and they can't go on forever, Owen Stipperick, Alwyn Jones and others, Lee half Halfpenny too. Jack Van Poortfleet, lovely move, Max Mears from Owen Farrell, was a Midland player taken out off the ball there and pushed forwards. They might score yet though, Farrell, they must use the extra men! Had gone to hand, but they managed to. Recycle. There, look. Oh, that's touch and go. But they managed to hold on to it and recycle it. And look at this now. Players overlap, big gaps between. You can see Lee Harpelling desperately trying to scramble back to affect that, but up against Anthony Watson. You know there's only going to be one result there. Really good attack from England. Yeah, there was plenty of white light on the outside. And Anthony Watson, what a return. Two years away from international rugby. He's 29 tomorrow. What's up, what's up? Oh, and it's been poached. And Ramos is away and clear. And that is going to give seven points to France. Just when Scotland. Forcing Scotland to regroup. And again, it's just the big zippy pass. They're very aware of Finn Russell taking the ball to the line. Smile on his face the whole way home for Tomo Ramos. Well read by the fullback. Picked off beautifully 